everybody, welcome to my channel. This is my first video. I am very excited and I'm very nervous. And if you guys have anything nice to say, I'm all ears for it. Um, again, I will get better, I promise. Uh, but yeah, so I was thinking about what to do uh, for my videos and I figured why not just do an introduction video? Get to know me, ask questions that you never wanted to ask. And I'm gonna tell you an answer and talk about just stuff that's going on in the media, stuff that's going on with with COVID-19. I'm not gonna talk too much about that because it's just, I, I can't do it. But, um, but yeah, but yeah, Rona has been a very bad house guest. So, all right. So I figured while I do that, I talk about that, I'm just gonna go ahead and do my makeup and see what we come up with. Uh, I did find this red headband, which looks super cute. And forgive me, I'm also gonna be looking in a little mirror right here just to uh, kind of get my stuff straight. All right, so. So, ooh, 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 I know, I know, necessary realness. There's something about her that I just like love. Realness. This is also a little slow, so I apologize. But, okay, anyways, so while I have that going on, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to put primer on. This is from Milk, the Hydro Grip Primer. This thing is freaking fab. And you really just need just a tiny little bit. It's a dollop. This is probably a little too much. So I'm going to whip my hair back. Mm. While I watch some stuff okay and another thing that nobody tells you what the hell is this what the hell man i am like breaking out like a mofo dude this mask acne is a thing it is a vibe honey good lord all right so let's go with as soon as today all right so i guess she's going to be talking about kylie jenner's Message to fans. Ooh, Patrick Stewart. I love him. He's amazing. Oh, he's one of those like pimp daddies. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, people that you just. Okay. Like, you don't even. You don't even think about it. I'm gonna lower this. And yeah, so. Oh, please don't tell me to drop this one. Oh, I did! I'm so excited. I did. Alright. I'm gonna be doing some concealer. Now, I'm someone that usually doesn't put on a whole lot of foundation. My, my skin, I just need, use it mostly just for evenness, just to even out the skin tone. So uh, because I want to even out the skin tone, I'm going to use two different colors. These have been my tried and true. This is from, uh, from Nastasia. A stop. What the hell? Anastasia Beverly Hills. And it's the color. Oh, good Lord. It's the color Warm and Neutral for the Stick Foundation and Caramel Stick, or right? Caramel, or oh, Caramel, whatever the hell people want to call it. 
All right, so I'm really just gonna put the lighter color underneath my eyes, kind of in the brightness areas. And you know what? I usually do my eyebrows before anything else, mostly because I hate how the product of the eyebrow spreads like on the foundation. It's ridiculous. I'm just gonna like, well, I still gotta find a way to sanitize this. Okay, I'm just gonna rub that all over. And it looks crazy right now. It really does. It looks, it looks insane. I promise it's gonna make sense. Just put that on the outer. And I like my skin to look like skin. I do not like looking like I have foundation you know like I'm just not that type of broad you know everything as close to natural as physically possible because I just don't feel like I need it so so weird so I'm just gonna take a beauty blender blend that out until it's just nice and blended ooh ooh Chris Evans oh my goodness he is a cutie pie. Just blend till you can't blend anymore. And I know it's fracking tedious, but it's gonna work out, I promise. I know uh, on the camera it actually looks very uh, yellow, but I promise, like in person, it's actually pretty blended in. Just gonna keep blending and blending and blending because what I should have done, I kind of messed up. <laughs> Good job, Jenny. You messed up on your first video. Good job. But what you want to do is you want to concentrate most of the foundation in the middle and then kind of spread it out to have that really like nice and even and even texture and all that stuff. And it oxidizes too. I promise it looks so weird right now. I promise it makes sense. I promise it will make sense. Okay, and then I'm going to take this foundation and just brighten the area up. I'm going to take it. And then a little pink. You can see I like that one. Oh, allergies. Allergies. Okay, so I can see in the camera right now. I know it looks really, really weird, but I promise it's going to make sense at the end. I promise. Right. 
I just did kind of uh, light contouring. I just got to crack my back, please. Ooh. Are they saying I have a chance? I promise the, the, lens, the ends of my eyebrows have always been like the difficult puppies, the difficult babies. And then I end up having to like put on concealer around it anyway because it's such a, it's a, it's so bad. The eyebrows is probably like the longest routine I have. It takes me forever. I'm oh, sorry, I can't do a whole bunch of talking when I do my brows. It's like concentrator, you know what I mean? Oh, they're talking about like Thank you, Jenny. Now you gotta blend that all out again because now your nose is, is red. Hey. I had to like itch my nose though, y'all. I tried. I tried not to. I tried to be like, let me just wait. Wait till the end. Maybe it just won't itch. Oh my goodness. And I'm just like, nope, I gotta do it. Because I am a Stubborn ass. Oh my goodness. You ever just like, uh, I don't know why, doesn't your body just all of a sudden like hurt? Not in like a sick, achy way, but just like a strained, like muscle tight kind of way. You know what I mean? It's just ridiculous. All right, so I'm gonna take this. I call it a painter pod, but I don't think it is. It's from RMS Beauty. It is the contour bronze. Originally, when I got this, uh, I I really did want it kind of like uh, like the Chanel Tan de Soleil. I think that's what it's called. It's a beautiful product. It's a product that I've been wanting to try for so long, but I just cannot get past like the what sixty five dollars or something like that. I don't know. I'll look at it and I'll link it down below. Um, 
it's just like the bougie of like to me cream bronzer so i was like maybe this will do it and honestly on my contour area it looked like dirt but it made a beautiful like eyeshadow or eyeshadow base so that's what i'm going to use this for i'm just going to take my ring finger and then i'm literally just going to like tap 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 and if it gets in the inner corner don't worry about it you're going to be able to you're going to need that for later gonna blend it on top and in the bottom I know it looks really bad right now but it looked kind of like see this is the thing on camera it doesn't it just looks kind of patchy but in real life it looks blended and that's like so that's so weird Okay. I like, I have to watch something. I have to like talk or else I'm just going to like go insane. Has anybody ever, has anybody been getting this feeling about just kind of learning about ASL? I'm just rubbing that in the bottom, kind of making a, a, a smoky effect. Let's give it like a, just a smokiness. And then I'm just going to take the beauty blender and I'm again just going to blend whatever, you know, I could not blend. All right, and then I thought I got it, but I guess I did it. Hmm. Let's see what we have here. Then again, I'm going to take my index finger. I'm just going to rub the product on. It's super pretty. It is from MAC. I just really love the color. It's a super just summery color. There's something about it that I just love. Check. rubbing that I really kind of want like a rocker look so I'm not going to worry about you know keeping it too neat I just kind of want it blended just really nice and smoked out Oh, that's right. Oh my God. It's the last season of Keeping Up with the Kardashians. A, I had no idea that they were on for 14 years. I mean, say what you want about them, but I can't knock their hustle. They turned a freaking sex tape, something that could have humiliated her and ruined her, and up becoming extremely successful for her and her family. Like, aren't they worth together like almost like two billion dollars or three billion dollars it's insane so i'm just kind of blending it from the bottom just really kind of uh, smoking it out yeah okay. 
And then I'm just going to also take Urban Decay, and this is Midnight Cowboy. And I broke it. So now it's like, you know. I broke it. So now I have to deal with And it's too little to fix it, so it's not like... This is kind of, this is not going to, honestly, I'm not going to lie. Not how I expected, but we're going to do this just fine. It's fine. If anything, this could be like, this is what happens. This is what moms do when they, like, you know, going into the second month of distance learning with their kids. How nice is that? Now I look like a fucking ghost. Dude, it's fucking ridiculous. What the fuck look is this? Like, I have no idea what's happening right now. I have no idea what's happening right now. Rush of some sort, darkest brown, and then I'm just gonna just on the lash line, just gonna rub it on the lash line. I just want to give the mascara some depth, something to kind of grab onto in terms of fullness. Anastasia Beverly Hills, like the eyebrow. It's fine. And if you want, you can just kind of. And whatever product. Okay, there you go. Now I look even worse. Great. So let's move on. And let's try to salvage this. Right? Oh my god, Mateo, oh my god, it's such a cute name. I like the name Mateo or Mateo. <laughs> oh hell yeah. What? Am I just what the f Oh my god. Are you for real? Why would you do that? 
that doesn't make no damn sense. Why would you do that? Ooh, ooh, then she needs to figure that out because, because that is a sign of something. Definitely not going to be um, commenting on that. Let's not get that started, please. It's ridiculous. Oh, yeah. Wants to be your friend. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. going to put on some mascara. This is the Milk Kush Mascara. Ooh. Now, I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. I'm not very good at putting on fracking lashes. So I put on a thousand pounds of mascara. I have tried doing freaking strip lashes, little individual lashes. I do not have the patience. I do not have the fracking time. I do not care. And not only that, like, I don't care if my lashes are, are short. I just want them, like, full. You know what I mean? Like, like what's her name? Aria from Pretty Little Liars. Like, in that intro, like, she has, like, Lucy Hale has the, the most fullest, the most fullest lashes I've ever seen. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad for kind of what I'm doing. Yeah, yeah. It's not bad. I will say this though. It's really weird. I'm normally just listening and doing my makeup at the same time. But I do like to talk, too. But I don't know. Is it, is it just me or, you know, like you're, you feel more natural when you know a camera's not there. And then all of a sudden, even though you're by yourself, a camera is here and you're like, uh, I don't know what to do. Is she still talking about throwing up? Oh, wow. Yes, I feel like that.
that's so cute. No. Okay, but see though, it's coming together. It's looking less. Big girl.